okay? Heterogeneous mixture. Blood has a component of plasma, RBC, white blood cells, and platelets. Take note class, itong apat na to class, ito ay component ng blood. Okay, hindi to sila nag-mimix together. Ibig sabihin, nasa blood sila, composition sila ng blood. Kaya ito ay example ng heterogeneous mixture. Hindi natin sila makikita class through the use of our eyes, kundi makikita natin ito gamit ang microscope para makita natin o ma-identify ang RBC, R plasma, WBC, and platelets. Next, a homogeneous mixture class is a mixture in which two or more substances are evenly mixed on atomic level but not bonded together. The individual of atoms or compound of each substance are mixed. Air is a homogeneous mixture. Another name of homogeneous mixture is solution. Example of homogeneous mixture class, meron tayong milk, toothpaste, mayonnaise, or homogeneous mixture. Sila din ay tinatawag din natin colloids. Okay? Okay? Next. Ang colloids class, in a colloid, the particles are mixed together but not dissolved. Okay? Next is, the particles are relatively large, are kept permanently suspended. Halimbawa, pag ikaw ay nagmix ng flour at water, pag pinaghalo mo yun sila class, may mapapansin kang buo-buo. Ang tawag nyo po doon ay colloids. Okay? Thank you. Next. How do compounds and mixture differ? The substances that make up better, the substances that make up better are not chemically bonded. Mixing is a physical change, but the substance that exists before mixing still exists in the mixture. How do compounds and mixture differ from substances keep their properties? Substances that make up a mixture are not changed chemically. You can observe some of their properties in the mixture. Example, sugar. Sugar in water class. Ang tong dalaw na tong sugar, sugar at water class, ito ay compounds. Okay? Pag hinalo mo sila class, ito na yon. Okay? Pag hinalo mo sila, hindi mo na makikita ang sugar dito. But you can still taste it, the properties of sugar, which is the sweetness. And also, you can identify also the liquid states of the solvent. Kaya ito class ay... Hindi nagbabago yung substance pagdating sa kanilang properties pag pinaghalo nyo po ang dalawang substances. Next, compounds do not keep their properties. The properties of compound can be different from the properties of the elements that make it up. Sodium and chlorine. Okay, this sodium and chlorine, pag pinagkumbanya sila class, magkakaroon tayo ng table salt. Okay. Kung makita natin ang table salt class, hindi na natin makikita yung sodium na soft, opaque, silver metal. Pag sa chlorine naman, hindi na natin makikita sa asin class yung greenish at poisonous glass. Ang makikita na lang natin class, yung mismo itsura o yung result nila na table salt. That is why compounds do not keep their properties. Okay? Hindi nakikip ng properties yung compounds na substances. Next, mixture can be separated. The substances that make up mixture are not bonded together. As a result, you can separate them from each other using physical change. Okay? The physical properties of one substance are different from those of another. You can use these differences to separate substances. In contrast, you can separate compounds only by chemical change that breaks the bond between the elements. Take note class, pag mixture and, sa mixture class, kunyari yung salt at water, pag, pag pinaghalo mo yun at gusto mo silang separate, ang gagawin mo lang class, painitan mo lang at mag-evaporate ma, mag yung, yung tawag nito, um, solvent at yung salt na iiwan. Okay? Yun ang isang paraan para ma-separate natin class yung isang mixture na substance. Next, here, we have mixture class. Okay? Para ma-separate natin ng mixture class, pwede natin gamitin ng filtering, boiling, or using magnet. In a combining substances class, kailangan natin mag-mix ng substances at mag-dissolve ng substances. 
take note class, ang mixture, ito, uh, it may vary the composition of the matter made of two or more substances mixed but not bonded together. Pwede silang separate into substances by physical method, two types of mixture, the heterogeneous and the homogeneous. Tatanda nyo class, pag hetero, hindi uh, hindi siya even ang pagmimix. Marami kang makikita ang parts. Pag sinabi mo namang homogeneous, evenly mix. Iisa lang ang makita mo o uniform yung makikita mo. Okay? Okay? Example. Okay, homogeneous mixtures and heterogeneous. Lahat ng ito class ay, homoge ay heterogeneous rather. Okay? Kasi nakikita mo yung mga parts ng, ng o ingredients ng bawat food. Ito rin. Hetero din to. Heterogeneous to class. Example. Okay. Ito ang homogeneous kasi iisa lang face na makita mo. Coffee lang. Di mong, dito, fury lang. Yung parang liquid lang dyan na green. Tapos milkshake, orange juice, tomato sauce, a tomato soup rather, and chocolate. Okay? Homogeneous to class. Magiging heterogeneous lang to class. Pag may nakita ka sa milkshake na pearl, pag may nakita ka dito kung anong-anong nakalagay, kung may nakita ka dito sa taas, hetero na siya. Pero pag ganyan lang siya, class, ang tawag niyo dyan ay homogeneous mixture. That's all for today. Thank you and God bless.